Sarasota police have a new tool in their arsenal to keep the community safe. It's a unique social media network that can connect them to people in ways Facebook and Twitter cannot. And News Channel 8's John Rogers joins us now live to tell us what this app is all about. Hi, John. Good evening, guys. It's called Nextdoor. Think of it as a modern-day community message board that informs and brings the community closer together. And the Sarasota Police Department is now using this to share messages that could otherwise be overlooked. The Gillespie Park neighborhood is a little slice of Americana. I've lived here about going on two years now. I, I can tell you I know all of my neighbors in this neighborhood. Yvonne De Simone says along her street, everyone knows what each other is up to and they always make time for potlucks. I like to um, refer to it as sort of old school. And it's thanks in part to 21st century uh, connectivity. Services. Most of DeSimone's neighbors Day use the Nextdoor app. It's a great tool for all of us. It brings us all together. You could call Nextdoor a hyper-local social media network. It allows people in specific neighborhoods to keep in touch with each other, from sharing recipes to finding lost pets. And now the Sarasota Police Department has joined in. Well, the next door is just a chance to connect more on a neighbor level. It comes in handy for specific targeted messages that might otherwise be lost. For example, earlier this month, officials used Nextdoor to warn Gillespie Park residents about a string of home burglaries. We just put a, a message out specifically to that area, and so folks that lived in that area and the surrounding areas were aware, but we didn't make that white noise to the entire city because it wasn't affecting the entire city at the time. It's another way for the police department and the community to team up and fight crime. It gives us a closeness with the police department. It gives us a sense of security that, um, not that we're being watched, but that there's someone here that we can depend upon. The Nextdoor app is free to use and to install, and it's already being used by neighborhoods all throughout Tampa Bay. But officials do stress, though, that if you really do need to get in touch with the police department, it's best to do it the old-fashioned way, whip out that phone, and call 911. Back to you guys. Absolutely. All right. Thank you, John Rogers, reporting live.